the young women and the young men that are on this campus in our athletic department, they are here with number one purpose to get an education and a close second to compete at the highest possible level. I do love playing football. It feels great to finally be able to represent them. I've coached a lot of places and this was always a dream to come back to be the head coach at Kent State. What makes this athletics program so great is the people. It's a great place to be. People get their first taste of Kent State through athletics more often than not. And so we cheer like heck for football. We cheer like heck for everybody because when they win, we all win. There's a culture of excellence on our campus, especially in the athletic department, that people are very much attracted to. Five of the last seven years, we've been battling for a national championship. Our women's basketball team is emerging. Um, it's been fun these first two years to really put together a roster that could compete and to attract young ladies from across the country. 24 Major League Baseball players uh, have, have worn a Kent State uniform, over 100 draft picks. And I tell my players, if you outwork me and you're as passionate as me, we will be champions. It's pretty cool to see where I've come from since freshman year. We have coaches on our staff that push us to be better in life and as well as on the court. It's a lot of fun being around this coaching staff and it's really easy to trust them because you, you can tell they know what they're talking about. We as their coaches measure ourselves based on what they do for the next 40 to 50 years. And so folks have a chance to contribute to someone's lifetime success, which then in turn is something to be very proud of. We do things the right way here. The balance between athletics, academics, and social. I know they talk about it. Listen, we preach it here. We've improved and increased our GPA overall for our student athletes every semester for the past eight semesters. Everyone's like, why'd you go to Kent? And I was like, well, I mean, their academics are so good. The ultimate goal for a student athlete is to get seen and play. So we're gonna try to get the best grades we can to stay on the field or court. Our support network is second to none here at Kent State. The Academic Resource Center provides them an area to get specialized training, get tutoring, get other services provided to them that help them academically. Student athletes coming out of Kent State University are hardworking. They overachieve. There's a high structure level here. So when baseball or their sport comes to an end, if they're ready to get in the real world. I'm a corporate real estate attorney right now with my own firm. Um, and absolutely being a student athlete helped me with my career. The investment that our generous donors make in our program has had a significant uh, impact. We've been going to the NCAA tournament regularly and we've won 14 MAC championships in the last 15 years. So that success I think has really greeted our alumni to come back and really support and you just see this program growing. We built this new facility in, in, and it opened in September of 2007. The ranges, the short game area, the outdoor putting green, fabulous. But then the real key is that indoor facility. We've got a 3,000 square foot indoor putting green. We've got video stalls. To be able to hit and putt and chip pretty much all year round, it helped just keep your groove going. We've got a track man. We've got a sand putt lab. This facility helps every single player here get on a new level. Our baseball program, we've had some very generous supporters step up and make some leadership gifts towards our recently completed baseball and softball hitting facility. The results are obviously speaking for themselves with the championships that these young men and women have won for us. A couple years ago, we announced our Building Champions campaign, which addresses the needs that we currently have. We're gonna sustain our growth and grow the quickest through private support. We do need a lot more assistance to get us to the point where we can provide the type of scholarship responsibilities to remain competitive, and then also the facilities that we need to not only train our current student athletes, but then to attract future student athletes. It doesn't matter the size of the gift, it's just giving back to your alma mater, you know, and giving back so that the people in the future can have a better opportunity that you have. Their support financially is going to be the item that bridges the gap in how successful a student athlete is academically or athletically or how successful a program is long term. Giving back feels great. When you invest in a facility, you know, most buildings have a 30 to 50 year life minimum on them. And so people can see their money at work. When you meet and you see the student athletes and you have a sense of 
what a difference in their life this makes. We're very thankful for everything they do for us, anything they do for us. It makes you feel like, you know, you've gone for a full circle. We also try to give back in our time, and whether that's in the attendance of, you know, of as many events as we possibly can, and you know, just in terms of volunteering. When people invest in scholarships, they're investing in human beings, and, and for them to, whether it's an endowment or an annual gift, they're investing in someone's growth and development, not only as a person, but also as, as an athlete. We recruit against Pitt, Ohio State, and having those endowments uh, definitely helps us give an advantage against those type of schools. There's not been a better time to be at Kent State University than today. We've been successful in the past and will remain successful, but um, I don't know if we've hit our height yet, and that's, uh, that's what's exciting. If people were to get to know the kind of things that are going on at the university and the people that are there, they would embrace it the way that, that I do. I mean, it's really a special place. It's all about our vision, and our vision is to be the best in the country. So in everything that we sit there and we do, again, you talk about academically, socially, and athletic program-wise, we're gonna shoot for the stars.